easier to falconry to you about hereditary because it is October, October, and of course I have to talk about at least some horror themed things since it is our Halloween merch month is 50% off as well. So check that out at tntmtheshow.com, the store. So I heard Hereditary was really good, so I decided to check it out. I've actually been trying to watch it for years, but it's hard to find on a service that I actually have. It is on Max right now. It is not what I expected it to be. It started that way. With this lady, she's had a history of mental illness in her family. People in her family, they've killed themselves. Things have happened to them. There's been a lot of death in her family. So it really plants this seed of, in your mind, of, am I crazy? Could it be the same? Do I have any history of mental illness in my family? Do I? Did I pass that on to my kids? It, it really messes with your head. But then it turns out to be about something else. Because the mother dies and it creates this kind of domino effect. She has this daughter and she has this son, the main character lady. She is married as well. She makes like these little models, which were pretty impressive. The little girl is allergic to nuts. I don't know where they find these kids. And this kid alone like looks and acts creepy. Where did they find these kids? Like this kid looks, I feel horrible saying this, but, but a little freakish, right? And even that like got inside my head, which is, you know, you love your kids no matter what, right? Like no matter how like weird they act or, or the stuff that they do, you know, how crazy they drive you sometimes, like you love them to death. And so this took me on this crazy roller coaster ride of emotions because I'm a father now. Like if I didn't have kids, yeah, I probably would have felt it, but I wouldn't have felt it the way that I feel it now. I literally felt sick to my stomach and was like tensed up. I feel like from one point, at a, after, after a certain point, I was just tensed up the whole movie. The movie changed because even when this horrible thing happened, one of the kids, well, really both the kids, I thought it was gonna change and it could have gone so many different ways after that. But it didn't, it didn't go the way that I thought it would and could have with those things, which it, I just feel like this movie could have been about so many different things, the way that it went and then ended up being more about, spoiler alert, about curses and possession and and stuff like that. Personally, I don't like messing with that stuff. I, I, I like, I will not mess with a Ouija board. I will not like, seances not gonna do it you know mediums that kind of stuff like i'm staying away as far away as possible i do not mess with that voodoo because i i do believe in that stuff and i'm not messing with it because i don't want it in my life i like i won't even watch this i won't even watch stuff like that at my house because i don't want to invite it into my home and i realized that when i once i had kids it got me messed up it got me messed up inside. And I feel like if their intention was to make you feel things and make you feel a certain way, they achieved it. Because I just felt awful and I still can't, like it's staying with me. Like I, even last night when I was trying to go to sleep, I could not sleep thinking about that movie because it is horrifying. And it's not even necessarily scary, it's creepy. But it's not even like it didn't give me any jump scares. So I was kind of like, I wouldn't say I was disappointed on that end because I, I don't really expect that. This was more terrifying to me because of the feelings and emotions it made me feel and the thoughts it made me go across than anything else. So if you're into that, it's for you. If you're not, don't. Like my wife, she's over that stuff. She's like, nope, not doing it. I don't even know if I would not watch it now knowing, now that I've seen it. I'm not sure if I'd be like, uh, no, I'm good. Because as a film, it was phenomenal. It was a phenomenal film. Like I said, it, the way that it's shot, I feel like it's shot brilliantly. Oh my gosh, so impressed. Such an impressive movie. Oh my gosh, I, I just, I did not, I don't, I still don't feel good about it. Talk nerdy to me. Check out our Halloween merch, 50% off and free shipping at tntmtheshow.com, the store.